there's one thing we've learned about these little lion cubs. Oh, you did that deliberately, little one, just so that uh, my rest of my sentence didn't make sense. Ah, oh, there we go. One thing we've learned about these lion cubs, they love scapulars. Scapulars make an amazing toy. When the last buffalo kill around Buffalo's Hook Dam, they were busy playing with a scapula, and they're doing exactly the same thing with this buffalo's shoulder bone. I think it's the, the shape of it. It's, it's flat, it's convenient, it pops out easily, so it's not connected to the rest of the carcass, and it makes for a brilliant toy. Oh, lost little one lost it to one of the older cubs. Oh, you just got into trouble for bugging amber eyes. Go play with your scapula, little one. Let amber eyes rest. <laughs> Game of tug-of-war between two cubs of different ages. This is such a beautiful scene. I barely know where to look. <laughs> Every now and again they get their claws stuck in it. It's thoroughly entertaining. <laughs> right, done with the scapula for now. On to tree climbing practice 101. Oh, no, back to the scapula. They do have relatively short attention spans and there's all kinds of amazing things around a buffalo carcass <coughs> ouch tail <coughs> oh no the bigger and the stronger cub walks away with the prize for now but never, never worry, the little cub will get a chance to play with it once again, as soon as this one gets bored of it. I'm standing on it now. You see what a brilliant toy it makes. It levers when they stand on it, it's got ridges to grab it, bits of flesh to pull. <laughs> Just so much fun, endless amusement. My goodness gracious me, did you just see the belly on that cub? <laughs> These cubs are just bellies with legs and very sharp teeth in front. I couldn't be happier to see them look as healthy as they do. Oh, I've returned to claim my prize. Nope, never mind. On to others. Oopsie. <laughs> 